Hello there. You don't have friends. And I'm going to prove it right here in this video. Now, me, myself, I don't have friends either. I've had lots and lots and lots of people come and go in my life throughout the years who I thought were friends. But in the end, they all let me down, surprisingly. And I'll tell you why. By my definition, a friend is someone who's going to stick by you, not through the good times, but through the really, really bad times in your life. So I'm going to give you three scenarios that you should try out right now to test your friend. And you should be testing your friends out to see if they stand up to this challenge. Okay, three scenarios. Scenario number one. You're going to call up your friend right now and say, Hey, I need you to come over and help me bury this dead body tonight. Can you come over? See if they answer yes or no. Okay. Scenario number two. You call up your friend. Hey, I need $10,000 from you or they're going to kill me. Will you lend me the money? See if they answer yes to that question. Scenario number three. I've been culturally canceled. I've been blacklisted. I have been accused of something that is like Harvey Weinstein type drama shit in my life that the whole public is against me. But you know, as a friend, you're on my side, right? Let's see if they stick around in all three scenarios. If they say yes and stick around, then they are a true friend to keep and worth keeping. But if they hesitate out of all three scenarios, then they aren't really your friends. What you really have are acquaintances, okay? An acquaintance is someone that you know intimately for probably a long time. So you probably have a lot of acquaintances at school, at work, at the gym, wherever you are living in your little town or city or wherever you reside on this planet, you have a group of acquaintances, people that know you and you know them. Now I'm going to reverse it. Take those three scenarios that I just gave you and flip it on you. If your friend called you up and asked for these three things, would you say yes to all three of them? Ask yourself, honestly, would you, dare, would you bury a dead body for them? Would you lend them $10,000 to save their lives? Would you stick by them even if they are culturally canceled through thick and thin? Probably your answer would be no, to be honest. To be honest, you would probably say no. Be honest. Now, who, on the other hand, would say yes to all three of those scenarios? You already know the answer. Family. Your mom, your dad, maybe your brother, your sister, maybe your cousin. Family. Family. Pay attention to the ones that stick by you through your low points in life, okay? Those are the people. Those are your true friends, okay? Now, if you're a guy, you're complaining that you have no friends, be happy, okay? Be happy. I have no friends. I am very happy. Because it's better than having the wrong friends in life. And I've had lots of wrong friends, toxic friends, that I kept around, that I should have just disposed of long ago. And they show their true colors, like I said, when the shit hits the fan. So it's better to not have the wrong type of friends and to be alone. And wander the earth like a lone samurai. Now, if you're a guy, what do you need? Instead of friends, instead of acquaintances, what you really need are comrades. What are comrades? Comrades are not just people you know. They are fellow soldiers. These are the people that you're fighting in the trenches with. If you're a guy, you need comrades in life. Not acquaintances, not a friends. Yes, you need family if you have family. But if you don't have family, the next best thing are comrades. Now, if you want comrades, guess what? I am looking for comrades in my life. My goal is to build a global network of 
people that I can work with that complement my personality. If anything in this video rings true to your, your soul, then you know what I'm talking about. If you're looking for comrades like I am looking for comrades, I'm not looking for friends, I'm looking for comrades, click the link down below, okay? Sign up for the newsletter, okay? So you stay updated. I've got plans, lots of plans in store. So click the link down below. Thanks for watching. Love you and bye-bye. Yeah.